The new year brings a common resolution to take better care of ourselves, including shedding a few extra pounds. More people start diet and exercise programs in January than at any other time of the year, and it's easy to see why. Most people start out the new year with good intentions, and things go pretty well for the first month or two, but then the old habits sneak back on us and we're back to where we started. Trying to tackle the problem with an overly restrictive diet or an exercise regimen that you can't stick with will probably just set you up to fail, and you'll be making the same resolutions year after year. Take a realistic view of your diet and exercise habits now, and then commit to making reasonable changes that you know you can stick with. There's a lot to be learned from people who have successfully lost weight and kept it off. Some turn to formal programs, but many people just blaze their own trail and figure out what works best for them. Most eat breakfast every day, and following a low-fat diet is a common strategy, too. Not a big surprise, since most people know that fats are the most concentrated source of calories. But beyond that, keeping daily calories in check is the primary driver in determining what to eat. People who have successfully lost weight and kept it off also keep regular tabs on themselves. They keep food journals so they know what they're eating and so they can keep track of calories. And they weigh themselves regularly, once a week or more. They also get a lot more exercise than regainers do, averaging about an hour of activity a day, and it's usually walking. Successful maintainers also watch a lot less TV, averaging less than 10 hours a week compared to the national average of more than 35 hours a week in front of the tube. To get started, prioritize the changes you want to make and tackle the easier ones first. If you're not a breakfast eater, try some cottage cheese or yogurt with fruit or a protein shake. They're quick and easy first thing in the morning if you're not in the habit of preparing breakfast. If you tend to grab meals on the run every day, start by packing your lunch a couple of days a week or preparing a home-cooked meal once or twice a week. You'll have better control over your calories that way. Finding time to exercise is always a challenge, but it's vitally important when it comes to weight loss and maintenance. Think about what works best for you. Do you prefer a solo walk or a group exercise class? Are you more likely to work out in the morning or later in the day? Set a goal and work your way up to an hour a day. And it doesn't all have to be at once. You could take a walk to the newsstand in the morning, then take another walk on your lunch break or after dinner. Keep tabs on yourself, too. Keep a food journal, log your activity, and weigh yourself regularly. As your new healthy habits replace the old ones, your weight will start to take care of itself. And if you keep the weight from coming back, you'll have fewer resolutions, or at least different ones, to make next January.